I was bored on perplexity and I started asking it why silver so cheap and then it was giving me stuff about rarity and supply industrial demand versus investment demand cost of mining and extraction said so, I mean that doesn't take into account of everything you know it doesn't take account about recycling or weapons manufacturing or usage and you know they said that's a fair point so uh they you know went more into industrial demand and supply constraints cost of production investment demand price ratio and i noticed they they mentioned the silver institute up here on industrial demand saying that industrial fabrication uh counted for over 50 percent of total demand in 2022 that's a lot 50 half of the silver to, you know was and i'm like silver institute has been under scrutiny by places like uh wall street silver for manipulating the actual prices of you know what as of the of industrial demand so it could be higher than 50 percent and they haven't mentioned very much about how they only kind of glazed over the hedging that the investment is doing as well as barely talking about war munitions barely talking about how the banking system is taking in gold and silver at record levels uh and so i asked it where it saw it in five years it was saying like the it's plausible that the actual demand for silver could be higher to to than reported and they gave sources and comex spot price uh influence factors hedging activities by major banks and i thought that was really interesting And you can always just pause and read this stuff. So it said it still said that the predicting the price of silver could be challenging. They it's reasonable to expect that silver prices could be ha higher. However, this outlook must be tempered by the understanding that markets are inherently unpredictable and subject to a wide array of influences that can change rapidly so i was like all right so we talked all about this so could you just tell me two stories based on what this discussed uh just you know just just for funsies one story just an extreme scenario what could go wrong and the other story that's just short and poetic about the value of silver to the world and they put the tale of silver's descent in a world not too distant from our own, the silver market face unpredicted turmoil. The industrial demand for silver has skyrocketed, driven by its indispensable role in green technologies and electronics. Yet the numbers reported were manipulated, masking the true extent of the demand. This coupled with aggressive hedging by major banks and unchecked market manipulated, manipulation created a volatile storm. As years passed, the COMEX spot price of silver became a mere shadow of reality, manipulated by those who held the most to gain, the banks. Now deeply entrenched in their hedging strategies, continue to exchange silver for you as treasuries, artificially suppressing silver prices to bolster their financial maneuvers. The world watched as silver, the metal once heralded for its luster and utility, plummeted in value. In industries reliant on silver struggled to secure their lifeline, leading to a cascade of failures in sectors from solar energy to electronics. The Green Revolution, once a beacon of, home, of hope, dimmed under the weight of scarcity and soaring costs. In this extreme scenario, the manipulation and financialization of silver not only destabilized the metal's value, but also stifled innovation and progress, casting a long shadow over the world's technological and environmental aspirations. And then they wrote a little poetic ode to silver. In the heart of the earth, beneath layers of time and toil, lies silver. The silent sentinel of progress, its gleam, a whisper of the dawn, a reflection of the moon's serene gaze. Silver, the unsung hero 
of our modern world cradles the light of the sun in solar panels and breathes life into the devices that connect us. It is a thread woven through the tapestry of humanity's advancements, a bridge between the old and the new in its modesty. Silver does not boast of its worth, yet its value is immeasurable. It is a keeper of memories, cast into heirlooms, and the harbinger of futures molded into technologies yet to unfold. Silver in its quiet strength reminds us of the delicate balance between taking from earth and giving back to it. It teaches us that true wealth is not in possession, but the ability to advance, to heal, and to unite. In this poetic reflection, silver is not just a commodity, but a vital element that shapes our world, embodying the resilience and potential that lies within the heart of humanity and the earth alike.